What do you think, Talia? Um, kind of cool. Kind of cool. Are you ready to work on some apples? Yes. What are we going to make? Um, apple pie and stuff. Apple pie and stuff. Well, I think we're going to make applesauce and apple butter. What about we make apple pie? Uh boxes of apples we got two more out in the garage and our little apple peeler ready to go and I need to pull out our big stock pot so I can get a batch of apple butter going we're gonna just sit here in the living room we're in the living room right now we're gonna watch Master Chef on the TV and we're gonna work on apples together are you guys ready to work on apples <laughs> no? my finger, Mom. she is that's so nice I have you want to get a big apple? Uh -huh. Okay. See how big this one is? Maybe we should use it to make apple pie. Hi, Chef. What are you eating, Rue? Apple. Is it delicious? Mm -hmm. All right, here's our process. Autumn's nice. trying to peel the apples. But he's making like a little hole through there. Yeah, then just try on the other side. I see you. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> the peels. One more. And cores, yes. And our little apple muncher over here. So here are the apples in the pressure cooker that are going to be sauce. I'm just going to add just a little bit of water to the pot um, to get it started and then the apples will cook down and there'll be plenty of water from those. I'm just going to add a little cinnamon and I don't add any sugar. It's just a very simple recipe, and then I'll probably cook it on high pressure for about 30 minutes or so, and then see how it looks. Then over here, we have the apples for the apple butter. So I basically do the same thing uh, as far as the recipe. It just cooks down longer, so it gets a lot thicker. And I also add a few more spices. I add lots of cinnamon. I'm going to add an anise uh, star that I'll take out at the end no and I'll sprinkle some nutmeg and some allspice and let it cook down for quite a few hours. I wanted to show you my beautiful anise star. This one just came out and it was perfect. So, so pretty. Wow, that's awesome. Isn't that cool? Yeah. Can I see? Oh. Not pretty. Is that seeds? Yeah, it's a little seed pod. It smells like Black licorice. I just got all my applesauce into jars and I am going to go ahead and put it into my water bath canner. I was just waiting for it to get to a nice strong boil and then we'll get it canning. Now you can see here the fruits of our labors. And actually, this is only two of the three boxes of apples. I have all of my applesauce back here. I can them in bigger jars. And I got all of my apple butter here, and it's actually still cooling because I just finished up. I've got a couple little tiny jars to give away as gifts, and then these pint jars. I got, what, seven pint jars. And these, I think these are one and a half pint jars. They're so cute, jelly jars or what they called it, like the quilted pattern on them. So I got three of those, those will be good for gifts too. And that's, I made ginger apple butter and it turned out really well. And we're gonna be enjoying that for months to come. Hope you guys enjoyed this video and I will talk to you again later. Bye.